why do we so often overlook the whispers of our dreams, often dismissing them as mere figments of our imagination? How many divine messages have we missed by turning a blind eye and a deaf ear to the dreams and visions of the night? Too many of us ignore our dreams, not realizing the cost of such neglect. In doing so, we overlook potential divine revelations, guidance, warnings, and insights meant to steer us toward victory and our true purpose. Recognizing and valuing our dreams can be the key to unlocking the deeper spiritual direction, revelation, and fulfillment that we yearn for. Today, I invite you to journey with me into the heart of your dreams, into the essence of your purpose. We will explore how paying close attention to our dreams and heeding these divine whispers can make a difference in our lives. We will also look into what to do upon waking from a dream, encouraging you not to ignore these nightly messages. Whether you recognize it or not, they might be God's method of sharing wisdom about future risks, warnings, blessings, gifts, healing, guidance, and much more. I am also going to pray a powerful prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. My dear friends, have you ever stood at the edge of a vast, wide canyon, looking into its depths, feeling its impressive beauty? This vast canyon, with its detailed layers and hidden paths, reflects the challenges and depth of our dreams and the paths they urge us to follow. Just like a traveler might stand at the edge, thinking about the journey across or down into the unknown, our dreams also encourage us to move beyond what's familiar, toward achieving our divine purpose. In the book of Acts 2 verse 17, we are reminded, and it shall come to pass in the last days, says God, that I will pour out of my spirit on all flesh. Your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, your young men shall see visions, your old men shall dream dreams. This verse powerfully affirms that dreams and visions are vital ways that God chooses to impart His wisdom and direction to us, emphasizing the importance of being attentive to these divine communication. Understand that dreams are messages or narratives experienced during our sleep while visions are spiritual or supernatural experiences that often occur when we are awake, offering insight or revelation. Now, let us look at the divine whispers of dreams. My friends, dreams are so much more than just the subconscious mind's way of organizing the day's events. They are often laden with messages, insights, and guidance from God. Consider Joseph the dreamer in Genesis, whose dreams not only foretold his future, but also the salvation of nations. His God-given ability to interpret dreams, including his own, led him from the pit to the pinnacle of power in Egypt, demonstrating the profound impact of heeding God's whispers in our sleep. Dreams serve as a bridge between our mortal understanding and divine wisdom, offering us glimpses into the vast potential of our lives and the roles we are meant to play. They invite us to consider our paths, our decisions, and the direction of our hearts with a heavenly perspective. In the book of Job, in chapter 33, verses 14 to 15, the scripture says, For God may speak in one way, or in another, yet man does not perceive it. In a dream, in a vision of the night, when deep sleep falls upon men while slumbering on their beds. This scripture 
underscores the belief that God uses dreams as one of many ways to communicate with us, often revealing what we might not perceive in our conscious state. When we pay attention to our dreams, we open ourselves to guidance that can alter the course of our lives, steering us towards our divine destiny. I've witnessed this truth firsthand in numerous moments of my life. Even the creation of this channel, Daily Jesus Devotional, was the result of a dream given to me by the Lord. In this dream, what appeared to be an angel of the Lord directed my wife and I to feed God's sheep. At first, the path forward was unclear, but gradually, further instructions were revealed. And now, here we are, sharing daily messages of hope with you and others all around the world. To God be all the glory. We extend a heartfelt thank you to each of you for joining us on this mission to spread the gospel, to draw nearer to God and fulfill our collective purpose. And sometimes people ask us why our channel has been growing so quickly but we believe it's because we aligned ourselves with divine purpose. My friends, as you walk in your purpose, you'll find that things naturally fall into place. So this experience is not just for us. Each of us has our own unique purpose. When you are aligned with your God-given purpose, you will begin to see the favor and goodness of God becoming evident in your life. So we need to understand that within each dream lies a seed of possibility, a spark of divine insight, waiting to be nurtured into full bloom. Just as Daniel was given the wisdom to interpret dreams that confounded the wise men of Babylon, revealing deep secrets and earning him a place of honor, so too can our dreams reveal secrets meant to guide us, protect us, and propel us forward. The benefits of heeding to these divine whispers are manifold. They can provide clarity in confusion, direction in uncertainty, and peace in turmoil. Dreams can be a source of healing, offering comfort and closure from past wounds. And they can be a fountain of creativity inspiring solutions to seemingly insurmountable problems. Also, our dreams can serve as warnings, safeguarding us from potential harm or guiding us away from detrimental paths. Now, when we wake from a dream, it is crucial to approach it with an open heart and mind, ready to receive the lessons or messages that it may hold, the first step is to record it. The fleeting nature of dreams means they can quickly be lost to the waking world's demands. Therefore, if you don't record it, you may forget important details. Keeping a dream journal beside your bed allows you to capture these divine messages and narratives before they slip away. Be sure to record the date and any important details that you remember. Praying about your dreams and reflecting upon them can also provide insight. The Holy Spirit can bring clarity to their meanings and applications in your life. Engaging with your dreams means not dismissing them as mere figments of your imagination, but recognizing them as potential messages from God. Seeking discernment through prayer and reflection Perhaps even discussing them with trusted spiritual mentors can help unravel the divine messages woven into the tapestry of your dreams. My friends, understand that dreams are a reflection of our innermost desires, fears, ambitions, and sometimes divine insights. They can be a mirror reflecting our deepest selves back to us offering clarity and understanding that we might not grasp in our waking hours. This reflection can be both humbling and empowering 
as it reveals our vulnerabilities and our strengths, guiding us towards personal growth and spiritual maturity. The benefits of this divine communication are profound. Dreams can inspire us to pursue our calling with renewed vigor, comfort us in times of sorrow, or offer peace when we seek forgiveness. They can be a reminder of God's promises, His omnipresence, and His unfailing love. Also, dreams can serve as a vehicle for spiritual healing as they allow us to confront and process the emotions, memories, and experiences that shape our spiritual journey. My friends, dreams are an integral part of our Christian walk, a sacred space where the spiritual meets the physical, transforming our sleep into a time of spiritual renewal and divine revelation. Remember, be cautious about whom you share your dreams with, as not everyone may understand or support your dream. Also consider that some dreams are not meant to be shared with everyone. Choose wisely, seeking individuals who will encourage and inspire you towards achieving your goals. Now let us look further into dreams as divine guidance. My friends, dreams can often feel like a journey beyond the veil into a realm where, where the spiritual and the temporal intertwine. This is a space where God can directly communicate with us, offering guidance, warnings, and blessings. The Bible is filled with instances where dreams acted as a divine conduit. Consider the story of Solomon in 1 Kings 3, verse 5 where God appeared to Solomon in a dream, offering him anything he wished. Solomon's request for wisdom to lead his people rightly showcases the profound potential of dreams to influence not just individual lives, but the destiny of entire nations. Why is it then that dreams hold such potent potential for divine guidance? It is because in dreams, our minds are free from the distractions of the physical world, allowing the voice of God to be heard more clearly. In this state, our hearts can receive divine wisdom and insight that might otherwise elude us in the hustle of our daily lives. Dreams are a sacred space where our spirit is more receptive to God's voice, where the hustle of life fades and the divine whisper can be heard with clarity. Dreams can fortify our faith, offering tangible evidence of God's active presence in our lives. They remind us that we are not alone in our journey, that the creator of the heavens and the earth is intimately involved in every detail of our lives, guiding, protecting, and blessing us even as we sleep. Also, it is important to understand the protective power of dreams. Dreams not only guide and enlighten, but also protect. They can be a divine mechanism for warning us of impending dangers, offering us a glimpse of possible futures that we have the power to influence or avoid. The story of Joseph and Mary in the Gospel of Matthew is a profound example in Matthew 2, verse 13, an angel of the Lord appeared to Joseph in a dream, warning him to take the child and his mother and flee to Egypt to escape Herod's wrath. This dream saved their lives, highlighting how God can use dreams to protect his children. My friends, the benefits of heeding warnings from our dreams are clear. Preservation of life, prevention of harm, and provision of a way out of potentially perilous situations. I recall having a dream about a door in my house being open, and upon waking and checking, I found that the door in my house was indeed open. Dreams can be the means through which God shields us from unseen dangers, gently steering us away from harm's path while we are oblivious to the threats looming over us.
Recognizing and acting upon these divine warnings can be a matter of spiritual survival, as it reinforces our reliance on God's guidance and protection. Upon receiving a warning in a dream, it is crucial to respond with prayer and discernment. Seek confirmation and clarity from God, asking for the wisdom to understand the warning and the courage to act upon it. Share the dream with trusted spiritual advisors who can offer counsel and support. The protective power of dreams is a testament to God's relentless pursuit of our well-being. A divine safeguard against the trials and tribulations of this world. And now, let us turn our attention to dreams as harbingers of healing and blessing. My dear friends, dreams can be harbingers of healing and blessing. They can offer comfort in our sorrow, strength in our weakness, and hope in our despair. Dreams can be the medium through which God imparts to us the assurance of His love, the promise of His healing, and the certainty of His blessings. The story of Elijah weary and on the brink of despair, being ministered to by an angel while he slept under the broom tree, as found in 1 Kings 19 verses 5 to 7, is a vivid illustration of how God uses our moments of rest to provide restoration and encouragement. The why behind this divine provision lies in God's unfailing love and compassion for us. He understands our frailties our struggles, and our need for reassurance. In our dreams, He can tenderly speak to our hearts, offering healing for our wounds and hope for our hearts. Dreams can be a conduit for God's grace, a means by which He pours into our lives the strength to endure, the faith to believe, and the love to persevere. The benefits of embracing these dreams of healing and blessing are profound. They can transform our perspective, renewing our hope and invigorating our faith. They can remind us of God's omnipotence and His willingness to intervene in our lives in miraculous ways. These dreams can be a balm to our weary souls, a reminder that we are never alone and that God's promises of healing and blessing are as sure as the dawn. My dear friends, our dreams, those nighttime revelations that stir within us hope, fear, inspiration, and guidance are not fleeting shadows to be dismissed with the morning light. They are divine whispers, God's personal communication with us, each one a sacred invitation to engage more deeply with our Creator to understand His will and to walk the path that He has laid out for us with confidence and faith. Let this message be a beacon of light in your journey. Remember Joseph, who amidst the trials and tribulations of life never lost faith in the dreams that God gave him. His perseverance and unwavering belief in God's promises saw him through, from the pit to the palace, from betrayal to blessing. Let his story remind you that no dream imparted by God is too small or too big, and no path towards fulfilling that dream is without its divine guideposts and guardrails. As you move forward, let the words of Ephesians 3 verse 20 resonate in your hearts now to him who is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that we ask or think according to the power that works in us this is the god who speaks through our dreams this is the god who invites us to dream big to imagine a future aligned with his will and to pursue that future with the assurance of his presence his guidance and his unfailing love let us not be content with merely dreaming dreams, but let us be courageous in pursuing them. Let our dreams not be end goals, but starting points. 
gateways to a deeper relationship with God, a more profound understanding of our purpose, and a clearer vision of the world that we can help shape through faith, love, and obedience. My dear friends, I challenge you to embrace your dreams as divine gifts. Treasure them, ponder them, and pursue them with the assurance that the God who dreams with you is also the God who walks beside you every step of the way. May you go forth with the confidence that no dream given by God is beyond reach, that no obstacle is insurmountable with him by your side, and that every step you take in faith is a step towards the fulfillment of your divine purpose. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, Almighty God, the Creator of the heavens and the earth, the God who grants us dreams and visions and sets our feet upon the path of destiny. I praise your holy name. You are the architect of our dreams and the author of our purpose. Your wisdom is boundless, your power unmatched, and your love is everlasting. You are the God who spoke the universe into existence, and yet you whisper into the hearts of your children, guiding us gently towards the fulfillment of our divine calling. I thank you, Lord, for the countless blessings you have poured into my life and the lives of my loved ones. I thank you for the dreams you have planted in my heart and for the purpose you have placed upon my life. I am grateful for your guidance in moments of uncertainty and the comfort you provide in the times of distress. Your presence is a constant source of strength and assurance. Merciful Lord, forgive me for the times I have ignored your whispers, for the moments I have allowed fear and doubt to drown out your voice. I repent for not pursuing the dreams you have given me with the courage and faith they deserve. As I seek your forgiveness, I also extend forgiveness to those who have wronged me, releasing any bitterness or resentment. Cleanse me from all unrighteousness and renew a right spirit within me. Lord, I stand before you asking for the wisdom to discern the dreams and visions you have given me. Grant me the courage to follow them the strength to overcome the obstacles, and the faith to believe in the impossible. In the name of Jesus, I declare that every dream and vision you have placed within me shall come to fruition. I rebuke and bind every plan of the enemy to steal, kill, or destroy the dreams and purposes you have for me. In the mighty name of Jesus, I bind the forces of darkness that seek to cloud my vision that aim to silence your divine whispers in my sleep and seek to invade my rest. Lord, shield me from the torment of bad and perverted dreams, which seek to disturb my peace and purity of mind. Protect me with your unfailing love and mighty hand, ensuring my dreams are a place of comfort, guidance, and connection with you, free from fear or corruption. I pray for healing, Lord, not just for my body, but for my soul and spirit, that I may be fully aligned with your will. Protect me from the attacks of the enemy. Shield my mind from doubt and guard my heart from fear. Bless me with your favor and abundance as I walk the path that you have laid out for me. Lord, Extend these same blessings and protection to my loved ones, covering us all with your mighty hand. As I say this prayer, together with everyone listening, 
I am grateful for every heart that is humbled before you right now. We come in agreement as we pray for each other, seeking your guidance, wisdom, and protection. Together, we claim victory over our fears, declare healing over our bodies and minds, and celebrate the fulfillment of our dreams in you. May your Holy Spirit guide us, strengthen us, and empower us to achieve the purposes you have set for us. Let your will be done on earth and in our lives, as it is in heaven. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. If you were blessed by this message, type the word Amen in the comments section below. I declare that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you, in the name of Jesus. You can help us to reach more persons and spread the gospel. You can do this by sharing the video with a friend or family member who you know needs the blessing of this prayer and by clicking the like button. Also remember to subscribe to our daily Jesus devotional channel for more videos that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. We appreciate all those who support us. You're blessed to be a blessing. Now, for those who are listening and you want to accept Jesus Christ as your Lord and Savior, I urge you to receive God's grace with an open and repentant heart. Start where you are. Your past doesn't matter. Jesus came to seek and to save those that are lost. God loves you. It is not God's will that anyone should perish, but for all to come to repentance. Say this simple salvation prayer for yourself. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I am a sinner, and I ask for your forgiveness. I believe you died for my sins and rose from the dead. I turn from my sins and invite you to come into my heart and life. I want to trust and follow you as my Lord and Savior. Lord Jesus, hear my prayer, I pray. Thank you, Lord, for saving me. Amen. Now that you have prayed this prayer, you can ask a pastor to baptize you at a local church and make that decision public.